Hello, and welcome to the second episode of Deus Ex Mankind Divided. Um, let's get going with the story. We have just arrived to the Prag, and we have been blown up. More or less. Uh, the explosion hit Adam's augmentations. And we need to find out what's going on. We found we find ourselves in uh, Adam's apartment. Fancy. And let's get to exploring it. Yeah, you can immediately see that uh, the, text the texture quality is not exactly top-notch. I will see... Maybe I'll run another uh, test run separately to see if I can increase uh, the texture quality so that we can explore the books or stuff. Police blunders lead to Miss Trail. Six high-ranking members of the Dwali crime family walked out of the courtroom as free men today after it became apparent that state police had, once again, accidentally destroyed evidence in the Melikov sex trafficking case. What is it? Once again, accidentally destroyed. That does not look good on you guys. The judge had no choice but to declare a mistrial, mistrial once Officer Rehor Kaba testified that a handwritten ledger used to track the buying and selling of prostitutes had inadv inadvertently been shredded. He added that the officer responsible for the mistake has been placed on paid administrative leave while the matter is being investigated. This marks the third case this year in which members of the Dwali organization have escaped justice due to bureaucratic error. In an assurance hollow enough to echo through the capital, the mayor declared the state is launching an independent investigation into the chain of custody procedures. If corruption exists in Prague, we will stamp it out. Rogue arms dealer killed in Dubai. Interpol reports that John Trent, a dangerous ex-Bell Tower operative who disappeared during the Org incident, is dead. Trent's body was recovered during a sting operation in Dubai along with a shipment of weapons and banned black market augmentations. He planned to sell the contraband to augmented terrorists using the pseudonym Shepard. Okay, another cinematic. Yeah, you need to control moisture in your shower room because this is what? And it is completely dry? Forget what I said, your moisture control is amazing. Why did I do this? I don't even know what whether we placed some washing agent inside or anything, this was irresponsible of me. Interpol case file. The Juggernaut Collective originated in the early 2020s when a hacker named Eli posted a badly written calls to arms, call to arms type message on the darknet. Filled with misspellings and grammatical errors, it invited those disillusioned is illusioned with the strange hold one presenters have on our world to join him in attacking, exposing and spoiling the plots. The group first made sorry 
The group first made headlines in 2025 by hijacking atmospheric processors used by a popular weather artist in Paris and sending hurricane force winds to decimate a page industry's sponsored event. What kind of artist owns that kind of tech? Around the same time, Eli was replaced online by a new nom de plume, Janus. Efforts to ascertain the real-world identity of either hacker have thus far proven unsuccessful. Under Janus's leadership, the collective have become increasingly effective in bankrupting Fortune 500 companies, exposing governmental misdeeds, and in general making life difficult for the extremely wealthy. Particular worrisome to counter-terrorism agencies around the world is growing evidence that the collective have been recruiting a number of experienced agents, often with black ops expertise, to assist them. Aha! Uh -huh. You wanted to hide some crafting parts from me, Adam. Oh, I see a good boy. Guide on bias cells. Uh, yeah, there was alternate use, and I just prefer to skip it. Yes, sure. The secret fight against global terrorism weekend editorial. On the 21st March 2028, a chain of coordinated bomb attacks exploded in un unsuspecting cities and communities around the world. In that terrifying six-hour period, up to 50 low-tech but horribly effective devices destroyed lives and terrorized humanity one after the other. Too much, too late. It was the tragic reason the world finally heeded. Highlighted by a press already gorging on stories of bloody terrorism, the lack of communication and cooperation between international intel gathering organizations were cited as the primary reasons for the March bombings going unprevented. Normally bound and gagged with political red tape, world leaders reached across political fences as international demand for a unified and collaborative solution aligned across the globe. In the weeks following, UN mediators urgently proposed an international cooperative force with the power to act effectively across borders. Built upon the pace of the existing G18, the effort quickly expanded with 11 more willing political participants and Task Force 29 was born. Hey, Adam, I'm not drinking. Whose is this? Nice. Multi-tool. They can hack devices. You aim it, and you hold it, and then they discard it. Smart home. As you wish. Nice. Piercing armor for the combat rival, rifle and revolver. Some tranquilizer darts and stun gun ammo. And an empty stash. A 
out of sight, out of mind. From Christian Giraud. Oops. Sorry not to get back to you before this. Been buried in a sea of paperwork, and frankly, I'm surprised you're asking. Only met Miller once via the NSN. Seemed more than competent. He was with the tactical assault group in Australia before the incident. Hell of a marksman, so they say. Don't know how he ended up overseeing the Central European office. But then, I don't understand how you ended up there either. After Detroit, I figured your SWAT experience and my recommendation would get you in the door, but I thought headquarters would keep you in the States. Sure couldn't use your insider's knowledge of ARC developers to get a handle on the black market suppliers we've been chasing down. Hate to say it, but they're giving us hell. Oh well, adapt and react, right? Anyway, not much more I can tell you about Miller. If you do put him, if you do put in for a transfer, let me know first. Maybe I can pull the strings. Can I reply to the dude? Director from the North American Division. From Arrowson Hub, Hugh. This is an acronym. Adam, thank you for your detailed specifications for this trench code. As discussed, it will be completed within 10 business days and shipped express. Okay. From Peter Chang. Director Miller said you'll probably come in after a good night's sleep, despite what just happened to you. I have no idea why you would do that. If it was me, TF-29 is the last place I would want to go right now. Don't let the bunker atmosphere fool you, the place is a target. We are all targets. I'm not just being paranoid here, okay? You'll understand when we talk in person. Related to the above thing we need to talk about, I changed your office password. It's now the name of the band on the short Aria War more time than I more war the time I saw her, the one I told you about. I swear I'm not trying to be cryptic, I'm trying to be safe. Try running through your home smart system interface again and let me know if you are still getting that armory glitch. Latest firmware should have taken care of it. Last thing I'd want to do in your shoes is leave my apartment without bullets. Who's Aria? Name of the band on the Aria shirt. I'll keep you safe. As you wish. But remember, homeowner, this poses a substantial security risk. Adam! Thanks for calling me back, son. Seraph. I heard about the bombing in Prague. It's all over the news. Did anyone you know get hurt? You know me. I tend to keep to myself. I'm surprised you even know I'm here. Interpol called me when you applied for the job, part of their extensive background checks. I gave you a glowing recommendation. Thanks. What do you want? What do I want? Jeez, Adam! I know I did some questionable things in the past, but... A lot's happened in the last two years, to both of us. That's true. I don't want to be For a grumpy fuck. Worth, I'm glad you made it out of Panchea. Thank you. It wasn't easy, as I'm sure you know. I was at death's door by the time the rescue crews pulled me out of the wreckage, and while the doctors were stitching me back together, my company fell apart. Wasn't there anything I could do to stop it, not from a hospital bed. I heard Tai Young Medical bought everything up. They're the only biotech corporation that could, after the incident. Our patents, our tech, everything. <laughs> oh well, sometimes one dream has to die so another can rise from its ashes. You talked to Pritchard lately? Frank! All of us, I think he's the one who's changed the least. He'd probably tell you there wasn't anything about him that needed changing. I'm sure he would. But when the world transforms itself the way ours has, people need to adapt or get left behind. Frank's freelance now, but he's still in computer security, still in Detroit. I don't know if he'll ever leave. You heard anything from Megan? 
After all we went through, I thought she'd stand by me. Still, you know, she always wanted to be at the cutting edge. She didn't see a future for herself in Detroit, so she went to VersaLife. She moved to Hong Kong? San Francisco. They've got an offshore research facility there named Rokaseka Beach. I'm sure you've seen it in the news. California, huh? I wonder if she's told her mother. You want my advice, son? Write her out of your life. Because I'm damn sure she's written us out of hers. Your message said you were going to London. Casual trip? Or is this tied to the new dream? I'm, uh, meeting with the Santo group. Nathaniel Brown and his investors. Santo? They built the Udalek complex, the Og Ghetto, here in Prague. Why are you meeting with them? Brown's got big plans. He wants to focus on real solutions. Ideas that look to the future. Y you've heard of the Safe Harbor Initiative? I've heard of Rabia. The walled city he and his company are building in the desert for Augs? is just a part of it. We're talking about self-sustaining, energy-efficient arcologies that can be replicated anywhere on Earth. Cities built by the Augmented for the Augmented. Where the dream of self-controlled human evolution lives on. It may not seem like it right now, son, but one day, people will move on from the incident. And when that happens, we'll be ready for it. I'm glad we caught up, Adam. I've always tried to look out for you, you know. That bombing yesterday. You didn't call to talk about the bombing. Just ask. It's nothing, really. I just need a signature so I can finish filing the bankruptcy paperwork. You need my signature? Yeah, apparently there was some kind of bureaucratic mix-up caused by you being declared legally dead for a year. The apartment in Detroit was leased in your name, even though we paid for it. Fine. Send me the paperwork. Thanks, Adam. I appreciate it, really. Goodbye, Seraph. I feel some sort of... Like... This was clearly not a, the, the easiest conversation and it left... Like, like a shitty aftertaste, you know? You doing okay? Sorry about the downtime. I'll get to the office as soon as I can, but my augs took a hit during the attack. I need to get them looked at. Of course. There's a lot of work ahead of us, Jensen. I'll see you when you get in. Dr. Kohler, I need to pay you a visit. Jensen! Now's actually a really good time for me, like right now! Something wrong? There are some guys in my bookshop. Pissed off the valley gangster looking guys. So, unless you want bloodshed the day after attack. Aim at the reticle over the objective located to bring up the name. Oh. Better attack. The front door isn't the most peaceful option. I got it. Seems Kolo has run afoul of a local criminal gang. If I want him to fix me up, I'll have to get past the Dwali thugs who are tearing up the time machine and make sure he's okay. Just uh... Yeah... Check language is not my proficiency, so... Oh, at least this thing still works. Nie rozumiem angielski. I cannot believe it. Did just lose his daughter not so long ago? Yes, Christelle. A nice girl. She used to babysit my kids. Now this. You know, they are saying he was part of... of that attack. A member of Ark. Bullshit. He is just a poor Og with the wrong enhancements and the wrong connections. He outgrew his usefulness. Or they needed the apartment. Maybe for another wrench. 
If that's true, they could do the same to anyone. To anyone who knows him. How long until they evict us too? I wish there were more... Subtitles available. No chance you'll be evicted anytime soon, right? Traitor. Traitor? Tivoli, leave me alone, wrench. Run to your master. Why do you call me traitor? Tivoli, leave me alone, wrench. Run to your master. Terrible, is it not? Seems anyone can be guilty by association. Do you have anything interesting in your apartment? Security rating 4? Who are you, man? I saw something over here, did I not? No. When an augmented passenger broke into the plane's cockpit and ruthlessly butchered its flight crew. Details were causing the greatest loss of life in recent history. Well, hello there. Now oh, that's why you use this thing. Among other reasons, of course. is near Sever. You must hang on. There is always hope, Yosef. Do not despair. Seeker, you are here to see the Builder? He has been asleep, but I cannot wake him. I do not know if he will recover. The Mother has said that he has lost faith and that we should shun him. But I cannot abandon so easily. Do not give up faith in the church. Some of us remember, Builder. Okay. You gave us the means for our salvation. Do not veer now. We will all find our way to the machine gun. I pray that the mother will change the mind. A gun. A shotgun, probably. Would be more correct description.
Yeah, whatever it is, just give me everything. I still don't know what what of it I should take. So the machine god reached out across the empty vastness, looking for his people, the poor, the mistreated, those society had cast aside. And why were these people shunned? Because they looked different. Yeah. Religious literature is also not my virtue, so... Bridge software. Wait, no servers in here, but this is the play the best place for the server. First, let's verify that the apartment is clean. this my entrance? Daria Miska. Who are you? And why would you observe the entrance to my apartment? Why did you not clean after your cat? If you had a cat. I cannot speak for you folks, but terrifying memories of that day still haunt me. It will certainly be a while before any of us forget it. This is Eliza Cassell. So credit chips. And, oh wait, something neuropogen? Yeah, probably. Okay, that's a door the great and vast outside apparently. Non 
not give up faith in the church. And as if I never was here. My neighbor was augmented and they destroyed their apartment two years ago. Well, you are augmented yourself, so... Bio cells, painkillers, right over there. You want to do business, the man is over there. Daz is the man. He'll set you up. Trying to give me a reason to shoot you. I'm just picking up the stuff that you left lying around. You think you're welcome? Think again. A newspaper. I'm not telling you again. Go away. Okay, okay, okay. Sorry. I was... I just wanted to pee. So aggressive. Hey, I stole... Nope. This is a no Connor zone. There's no next time. Final warning, Connor. Trespasser! Show him the error of his ways! Follow me! I mean, why would you ever do that? Yes, it was... the chip probably belonged to the guy, and I kinda snatched it, and it was probably not very nice, but... Daz is the man. He'll set you up. You have heard the calling, Seeker? We have one. You want Praxis, eh? Biocell, hypostim, painkillers. I might be interested. I sell these things. Yeah, I got that. Buy something. Show me what you have. Weapons. Laser targeting system. Four times scope. Combat rifle. A pistol and a tactical shotgun. Some consumables. Praxis kit for 10,000. Some crafting parts and a bunch of ammunition. Tesla cartridge. If you say so. Do I have some excesses that I can sell to you? This is regular armor, this is EMP. I don't know what's what are those stuff. So let me just sell this stuff to you. Neuropogen. No, I'd rather leave it back with me. Get out of you then. I gave you such a good stuff way. and Think you are lost. being you waste my time. This is the beginning of a new age, and like always, change is first in fire and blood and pain. But the bright future is at hand for our people. Что? Nothing. Have you heard of this Church of the Machine God? It seems perfect for us. I used to watch all the gangster movies. I thought it was so cool. Then the first time I got held up, I actually pissed myself. Do you despair for your future? Do you search for something, some meaning, but never seem to find satisfaction? We have the answer. Seek and you will find. You will find
nice. There is a breakable wall. Teresa Petrauskas. Sums that newspaper. Resolution 3507, a problem for all. If you are augmented, you must be aware that the United Nations are sleeping peacefully at night beneath the cover of their olive branch with dreams of stripping you of your rights and dignity. The UN's Resolution 3507 is an obscene moral betrayer. Rooker's Ark are rightfully attacking the insidiously labeled Human Restoration Act for going against the very things the United Nations supposedly stand for. Without a control chip inserted for good behavior and official papers congratulating you on your loss of rights, resistant orgs will be promptly herded into more suitable accommodation courtesy of their local law enforcement. Welcome to Golem, citizen. But what if you are all natural 100% prime society stake? It doesn't affect you, does it? Consider this. 13 elected individuals have ruled that over 7 million human beings must give up their livelihoods without appeal to be licensed and monitored as if criminals, and I'm guessing you weren't asked for your opinion. Augmented or not, who will the next inscrutable world power some really judge as problematic. Resolution 3507 puts the world on notice that organizations like the United Nations feel they can do what they wish. It's time to tell them otherwise or become the next pariah in vogue. We have been warned. At the bottom of the deep blue secrecy. 2027 Pankea was humanity's uh, titanic plan to save the world, a 1.5 km deep installation plunging to the bottom of the Arctic Ocean. Built by a 100% augmented workforce, it was our hopeful answer to climate change, until it mysteriously blew up on the day the orcs went crazy. Two years after the incident, it remains conveniently unclear what happened at Pankea. Amidst conflicting reports of human remains, corporate sabotage and radioactive salvage, we wait for an official truth, engineering failure or another augmented horror story. More and more, Pankea feels like a trillion dollar hole in which to hide the trillion dollar secret. An appeal to basement humanity. They are augmented, are human beings. They are entitled to the same rights, privileges and recognition as every other human being the world over. But they are not receiving these basic and inalienable necessities. One might have expected, after their initial wave of grief and uncertainty had uh, run its course, that the augmented would have been recognized for what they truly were – victims. No more to blame and having suffered no less than anyone else. Instead, even more of their freedom are taken away as though their alleged transgressions continue on a daily basis. For this reason, it has been become undeniably clear that their violations are not going to be redressed without organized and directed action by a significant number of people. Some sort of activist group must be formed with a view to restoring basic human rights to the augmented, and this coalition of like-minded individuals must, must come together now. Oh, and you also have a usual newspaper. You seem to have a lot of newspapers. Sounds right. Man, like it is happening over and over again. 
and they won't stop until the city is destroyed. Until the world is destroyed. They say it was Ark, but it could be anyone. The girl on the corner, the delivery guy, you... Get away. Get out of here! So what do we have here? Unfortunately we do not have a way to get to the arms dealer apartment. I don't want to fuck with you either, but things need to change around here. I got the connections now. I got to the valleys. <laughs> With that kind of muscle, I can expand this whole operation. The only deal that the valleys in for 20. That's it. 20% guarantees Neon is the go-to drug all across Europe. 20% is nothing for that kind of reach. Well, I'm bringing the valleys, so I take 50% of what's left. It's only fair. Look, I am bringing the fucking Diwali's to the table. Bon Bon, from Andreas Jedinak. I keep hearing rumors that something is wrong. Someone's dealing Neon behind our backs. Do you think it could be Ivan? I never trusted this guy. I changed the password to our computer just in case. The password is now Dobranok. If you want me to do something about Ivan, just give the word, Andreas. I deserve a fucking bigger piece. Jensen, what are you doing? This is a champagne crate. Must be it might be dangerous. I think I got a lead on whoever's distributing behind our backs. Apartment 202 at 33 Hlavni in the Chista district. I heard some kids talking about this place. Something about neon knights. I checked our records, we have never delivered to this place. Wherever they get their shit from, it's not from us. Ivan. I got warm from Chernobog. He wants us to start moving mass shipments of Neon out of the city and he says you are the one to go through. And so I am officially making my request. Six crates of Neon to be left in my storage locker, you know the one. I will take care of getting it over the border. Make sure you are not followed. Vlasta from Roman. Rumor has it that the numbers you are pulling don't reflect the amount of neon on the streets. People say you are either skimming off the top or giving product away for free. We both know you don't do either of those things. So my question is, where is the extra neon coming from? The Dwali have a lock on production now that they've secured the web, and you are supposed to have a lock on distribution. If Chernobog finds out that the numbers don't add up, you are the first one he's going to suspect. Be careful, Roman. Side mission. There is a place known for its neon knights. Apartments, according to the name I found, someone in that apartment knows a way to bypass the Dwali controlled dealers. Needless to say, the Dwali aren't thrilled by the prospect of competition. Thank you. 
strong enough. You are one of the gifted men. All must be ready. Join us in the machine, God. How much longer is it going? Seeker, are you prepared for the ascension? I think you've got the wrong guy. No, I can see your purity. You are close, so close. And the Singularity Church of the Machine God can help take you the rest of the way. You know of it? I don't think your church can help me get where I'm going. Each of us lives with needs and desires, begging and howling for attention, for fulfillment. We barely have time to ponder what, if anything, lies beyond this wretched world. And you have some idea of what that might be? I am but a servant, tasked with spreading the word and offering hope to those who have none. But I have the teachings of the church to guide me. What would you like to know? This singularity church of the machine god. For augmented only? The word of the mother. Only the gifted will ascend. She has cast out the flesh flood in preparation. So you're here on a recruitment drive to fill up the numbers. And more. The Builder lives in this place, the dreamer of our ascension, now cast out at the will of the Mother. Let me guess, he's one of the flesh flawed. No, he simply had the crisis of faith. But I am not so blinded by my faith as others are. He was a friend once, a mentor, a leader in our church. Some of us remember. Do you have more questions? Tell me more about this ascension. Our minds will depart their corporeal shells and merge with the divine consciousness of the machine god. This is the ascension. Sounds like you're talking about uploading a copy of your brains to a computer. I didn't think that was possible yet. Thanks to the Builder, it is. But it is much more than a simple copy. It is transference. Yosef called it an evolution of the human condition. Do you have more questions, Seeker? I saw your builder upstairs. He's not doing so well. I was afraid of this. His flesh is failing, as his faith did. Perhaps the mother was right to cast him out before he could tarnish the ascension. Doesn't say much for your church that you abandoned someone for asking questions. Not going to do much for your recruitment drive. One of the chosen holds vigil. That is all I can do. Yosef's passion turned to bitter poison, and the flesh is weak. There is nothing more to say, Seeker. Do you have more questions? Nothing right now. Maybe some other time. Very well, Seeker. I will be here if you change Do you have more questions? The item has no other functionality than its substantial monetary value. part of the city I cannot afford a roof over my head. Oh prize to the truth to them I am no longer a person. I'm just an og. We are talking. Don't be naive. They have the reason. Ruzika. To them, I am no longer a person. I'm just an og. And we are all responsible for that bombing. I think you are exaggerating. That is just the fear talking. On both sides. I'll be honest. That church is sounding more and more attractive. They seem like they have answers. Maybe they will offer us sanctuary. Don't count on it. The church is nothing but a cult. No matter all the garbage those missionaries are spewing. I'll bet no one is harassing you about the bombings. Even if you are more likely to be involved than I am. You live upstairs, yes? Well, you should be alright for a while. No way they are evicting you. 
You will find me in the arms of the machine. Ahoy. Ne, díky. Takhle zoufalá snad nikdy nebudu. You, um, have anything on you? I'm desperate. I... I'll do anything you want, man. No one has to know. Tak nám děvoč, to jak nemá. Ok, this is one of the back doors. Oh my god. This is the front exit. Let's take this one. Map menu. It marks important locations including merchants, sewer accesses and metro stations. Landmark, my apartments and a merchant. Plus there is a sewer access. So both a beer, a merchant, Vincent van Og, another merchant. Konitsky and Hraki. Some kind of courtyard. Avant-garde, the Velvet Rock. Okay. Some checkpoint. Okay, cover with the time machine. Praha Mini Market. Church of the Machine God. Na ulici jí dneska není bezpečno. Radši se někde schovejte, policajti dneska řádějí. Look at what's been done and tell me someone isn't trying to control the Augmented. She knows about the heat squads and the secret societies and everything. Come on now. You're getting yourself worked up over nothing. Just relax. You're one of them, a secret soldier of the Shadows. Stay away! Leave us alone. Can't you see he is agitated? You holding? You must be. You look fine. Hold up. You can do it. License permit, voucher, document of authority, temporary pass, travel coupon, and or certificate of authenticity. Good old days, we just asked for ID. Good old days are gone. Oh, haven't seen one of these before. Orange level. You are some kind of badass? Just someone with a job to do. And the tools to do it, obviously. Go on through. Well, thank you. But that was a shitload of papers. They asked from me. Yes. New regulations for updated citizens. Cool. Always nice. What can I get you? Beer? Something else? What else have you got? Oh, just an item of interest. For someone who lives off of their sales, you're unusually reserved. Well, sometimes it's hard to know who to trust, especially these days. For example, I don't suppose you have any neuroposine you would be willing to spare, do you? Well, that's exactly the case why I sure. collected it and did not sell it, so... Thank you. I can't tell you how much this means. These are tough times. We all have to do what we can. You understand. That's... 
You have no idea how many people just look the other way. But we can't afford to. Not Augs, and not anyone else. What happens to one happens to all of us. The Neuropazine isn't even for you, is it? <laughs> no, it's not. I'm what you might call a... Well, I think of myself as a Samaritan smuggler. I get things for people in need. I'm glad I could help. Listen, I can't let you leave without thanking you properly. I store a few supplies in the basement. The code to the door is 1015. Help yourself to what's down there. Thanks. Don't mention it. Like you said, we all need to help each other. Now, is there anything else I can do for you? Let's see those odds and ends you have for sale. First eight pack. I'm good for now. As you wish. Is it the same? Jensen, I'm getting worried. Should I be calling every police station in town looking for you? That's not necessary. I'll be in soon. Good, because we've got work to do. That we've seen. Nothing in here. The ebook. The next three decades. Okay, for the last 250 years, the United States of America has flourished. Both the government, both the population, both populous. The next three decades will not see the complete dissolution of the United States, but there are strong rumblings that some states will secede from the Union. Teresa from Pavel Davidov. Man is really nervous about the latest shipment and is starting to say he wants out. There is not a lot I can say to make him feel better, unless he go back to the usual schedule. The handlers at the Utulak warehouses are used to seeing the driver rosters, and I'm worried that the lads going to fold if they start asking too many questions. I know you think the medicines and stuff is important, but I don't want him to lose his job or worse because of me helping you. If you really can't wait until the usual, then you are welcome to move the stuff yourself. It's all in the basement at Dai Taga as normal. 5622 will get you inside if I'm not around. My advice, sit, wait, and don't fudge up a good thing. So, if I understand correctly, there should be some kind of a... Damn it. And I assume I cannot just take these things and uh But I can clip through some way. Well, that is nice. Unexpected. And nice. Some sewer thing. 
Where the hell am I? First, let me try to repeat the stuff. I mean, I am augmented, so I think that's totally explainable. I mean, that's some speedrunning technique, yes? I'm pretty much sure that you just try to do crazy stuff uh, until you just clip through it. Where was my helper? Clip myself with the help of the door. I see now. Now, is there any actual use in clipping that hard? Yeah, bio cells, other stuff, propane. That's always nice to see. I'm just not sure I will be able to clip back from here. And that's, I believe, my biggest issue with this method. Like, yes, there is this. Where does it lead me, though? No idea, and it's locked. Press the button again? I don't think so. Oh, uh, ahoy. I swear the ignorance of some people is beyond my comprehension. I'll just walk. I'll meet you there. It'll be fine. You're claustrophobic? No. I... Uh, I'm afraid it's going to happen again. What? What happened at the train station? Look, I know it's scary, but you can't go through life waiting for something horrible to happen. The humans here must want out. Cool. This church isn't like that at all, at least from what I've read in their literature. Yeah, I've heard their mantra. Cast off the bounds of flesh and blood, embrace the singularity. Kind of freaks me out, it all seems a little too doomsday culty. I think it's beautiful. The idea that we are all one, that's something us augmented need now more than ever.
What? Ah. Well, in any case, let's make a stop around here. Uh, we're exploring Prague. We are looking around what is there for us to find. It will definitely take us some time, yes, but we are doing what we can. Slowly progressing. Um, I'm just thinking that previously I, I do not remember what was about this church or any of my interactions with the church. I don't remember them. That might be interesting then. In any case, uh, thank you for staying with me. I hope you enjoyed the content. And in such a case, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, let me know down in the comments what I can improve for you. I hope to see you next time. Have a nice day out there, and bye.